Politics vacation order. Yoruba patriots have been returning from overseas to defend their fatherland. Igbohu claim. Yoruba freedom fighter and activist Sunday Adeyemo, popularly known as Sunday Igbohu, hailed Yoruba leaders for backing his fight against insurgency in the region. Igbohu said he is particularly happy that the leaders are making comments at such a critical time when the security of the region has come under threat. Igbohu had been in the news since last week when he gave an ultimatum to killer headsmen to vacate a Parapa area in Oyo State. In a viral video on the internet, he was seen commending Yoruba elders for making submission on the issue. Igbohu said, I want to use this opportunity to thank all the Yoruba leaders and elders who supported us both home and abroad. Dele Momodo, former President Shegun Obasanjo, former aviation minister Femi Fani Kayode, former governor of Ekiti State Ayo Fayoshi, all our leaders, Alao Akala, Nobel laureate Wole Shuinka, the Alafin of Oyo Empire, His Imperial Majesty Oba Dr. Lamidi, Olaiwola, Adeyemi the Third, Onirisha Adeyeyi Ogunsi, Olubada of Ibadan, Sadiu Adetunji, Awujaile of Ijebu Kingdom, Sikiru Adetona, Oba of Lagos, Rolwan Akinolu, and Are on Kakamfu of Yoruba Land, Ghani Adams. They have all spoken up. At this stage, do not let us disrespect our leaders in Yoruba land. You might not know they are not happy with the situation. They all alert. They have started speaking up. They won't accept the killing of their own people by Fulani headsmen. Look at all the influential Yoruba people who have made submission that if President Mohamed Buhari tries anything funny, there will be war. Go and listen to it on radio. They said if Igbo gets arrested, there shall be war. Igbo also said the importance of the issue had made some Odudua patriots to return home from overseas to join in the fight against banditry in their land. He said, you came back from South Africa. This, my brother, came back from London. People are arriving from overseas because this is a serious uh -huh. issue. We are suffering. Fulani ex-men kidnap and kill us on our fatherland. The activist had earlier said he was confident that the monarchs in Yoruba land, we are solidly behind him. Thank you for listening to this news. This is what's supposed to be happening. Exactly what's supposed to be happening. That is what is happening now. Yes. You see, there is something I love about this uh, South westerners um they are very much united did you need to take note of that they are very much united and they have confidence in their own in their home they have confidence in their fight for freedom you see that I love that. Look at, see how all of them, both home and abroad, stood firm behind Sunday Igbohu. 
they believe so much in him and that is what supposed to be that's how it's supposed to be standing in gap for a leader for a for, for a leader an activist who is fighting for the freedom of the of of the of the of the of the, of the region is something that uh, that one cannot just overlook because it takes lots of courage and confidence to stand on behalf of a re of a region we're not talking we're talking about the state and for that decision that they took concerning the arrest of Sunday go is another very beautiful one this is one thing I love about the southwesterners not like our southeastern governors that have been sold away sold away to the president you see Look at the statement. If anything there happened to Sunday go, there will be war. Look at. Can we have such kind of support from the Southeast? It has always been only in the canal and only in the canal. None of them has ever stood by in the canal and said we are in support of you. They just left only the young man. Just him alone. You see, this is what is annoying now the canon. And they are claiming that they are supportive. And they are claiming that they are strong and in support. How are they supporting? How are they supporting, if I may ask? Is it our people that are dying in numbers? <laughs> My dear viewers, we are not getting any single support from our leaders. Instead, what we are getting in return is death in numbers. And it is completely wrong. Completely wrong. You see that? So, my dear viewers, let us not give in to the trick. Because to me, it's a trick. And should not be succumbed. Should not be succumbed and should not be welcomed. Because all these things that they are doing is what is giving this so-called Fulanese the courage to be visiting uh, the, 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 the community and be committing all sorts of atrocities. That is it. Yeah? So please, my dear viewers, I still look up to you because I believe that you have something to leave behind. So please, whatsoever it is, deem it free to leave your comments below the comment section. Click on the subscription buttons as well as the bell buttons to get updated whenever we upload any new videos. Thank you.